Thanks. こんにちは、おはよう、こんばんは。これはホロナイトへようこそ、お願いします。私は人事ユーシです。<笑>すみません。All right, welcome back, guys, to Hollow Night. I will pour myself another drink. Take the five that I owe. Oof, that's more gin than I put in before. I need more juice than that. Pardon me for just a moment. Professionalism. There we go. Stir on up. I'm moving on up to the sun. I'm moving on up. Oh, yeah, that is more gin. I'm okay with it though. Alright, so five drinks. Okay, so here we are, back in Dirt Mouth, and actually, I have something to show you now that we're here. We can climb back up here to the starting area where we entered Dirt Mouth. And this way. I can grab this. This geo deposit that I neglected to get in the first episode. But there's more. You know what? There's some lifeblood here. I'll take it. No, come back. There we go. So if we go all the way back to where we started. Whoopsie. Well, there goes one already. I'll take one. Whee! There was this small section that we found a geo deposit in, but we can actually climb up it if I can get <laughs> if I can get up there. There we go. And we can climb. Basically, all the way up. Oh, looked like a wall you could break. Aha! Here we are at the Howling Cliffs. So, up further this way, this is the start of the introductory cinematic with this little lamp here. And be on the lookout here is where you can see Hollow Nest. So this is where we jumped off at the beginning. But now we can backtrack a ways. And see what this doofus missed on his way. First of all, you're about to meet one of my favorite characters. Missed it. Aww. I lost my lifeblood. That's okay. So here, we have our first nail master. <laughs> Mother. Huh? Ah, well met. Yes, I thought I sensed the aura of a fierce warrior approaching. I'm impressed you found my sanctuary here at the top of the world. No doubt you've endured many trials. And can, how many voices can I give this guy? <laughs> no doubt you've endured many trials and overcome many foes in your quest to find me. No, don't speak a word. I, Nail Master Motto, who was taught the art of the nail by the great nail sage himself, hereby accept you as my pupil. Let us begin the lesson immediately. Yes, learn the nail art. Yes, There's someone hammering below me, so I apologize if you can hear that. We've mastered the Cyclone Slash. 
So now when we hold the attack button, can you stop? Oh no, that's outside. There's a workshop not uh, 350 feet from my apartment. And they're quite loud during the day. So if you can hear that, I apologize. <laughs> Okay, that's in my apartment. Your form. Exquisite. Now I know how my own master felt when he passed down his teachings to us. I hope you don't think me too forward when I say that I consider you to be my child. Yes. When I saw you perform my nail art, I felt a bond between us suddenly flash into existence. You honor me beyond words, my pupil. Thank you. Mama. Finna. Yes. I love you. You honor me beyond words, my pupil. Thank you. So there we go. Oopsie, I did it again. So now, when we hold our button, and we press up, we do a cyclone slash. It's very cool. I need to go out and test it. Thank you, Mato. I will use it wisely. Oh, and if you head back in... Oh, it's doing the thing again. I reviewed the uh, the footage in the last episode, and it turns out you guys can't see the issue I'm dealing with. Uh, there's uh, a, a pair of headphones apparently trying to connect to uh, my PS4. But you guys can't see it, so it's alright. So if you come back to Mato, you've come to visit your old master. This is an honor I scarcely deserve. Please sit. You're always welcome to meditate here with me. You can just sit and chill out with him for as long as you want. <laughs> it's very sweet. I'll drink to that. Alright. Have a good day, Mato. We have a father now. <laughs> I love him. He's so sweet. Oh, There's a drink. So this attack... Oh, hello. It's Gorb. Here lies Gorb, the, angel, the great mind. I actually uh, need to mark this on the map. Oop. Nope. Not that. Uh, this and this. Up here. Uh, markers. How do I... I need to put a pin down. I forgot how I did it. Oh, here we go. I'm used to playing the switch, so X is on the top. Ah, uh, boop! There we go. The other shelves a pin for you now. We'll come back to you, Gorb. Ah! There we go. Oh boy, getting the burps now. Okay, this just heads back. So while we're here, we might as well explore the rest of the Howling Cliffs. Oh, I almost screwed that up. Oop. Arigato. Hmm. Ah. The Great Descent. Tons of floating platforms. You'd think someone would deal it with this. So here. We <laughs> We quite literally have the edge of the world. We cannot progress farther than this. We oh, you can't even dash through it. Hello. A king's idol, okay. So we have here what is quite a rarer collectible. A white idol depicting the king of Hollow Nest. 
the elusive king was worshipped through through these idols. So this has quite a bit of value to our vendor friend. I believe it's around 950 geo, which is ridiculous at the beginning of the game. Nope, I'm good. Ooh, geo. Give. There we go. There's all kinds of goodies you can explore or obtain in this area. Higher beings, these words are for you alone. These blasted plains stretch never ending. There is no world beyond. Those foolish enough to traverse this void must pay the toll and, relinqu and relinquish the precious mind this kingdom grants. Yeah, I think we're okay. I think we'll keep our mind. Hello. A wanderer's journal. We got more collectibles. And another wall we can bust through. Ah. Okay. So what this is right here, this is the entrance to one of the DLCs of this game, the Grim Trope. So later on, when we have another power-up, I'll come back and show you this. Uh, I need to set an important marker here. Let's see. Let's set a gold marker, because that is very important. Okay. We shall return to this. Whee! <laughs> Continue finding the goodies. I think the platforming is very charming in this game. Until you get to what's called the uh, the path of pain. Oh, I know that humming. What's up, Cornifer? Enjoying the bracing air. We're close to Hollowness borders. We're quite close to Hollowness borders, and those desolate plains that surround it. In this direction, I'm about as far as I'm willing to go, though its caverns have been a pleasant change from the tight confines of the... Though... It's been a... Okay. I swear I'm dyslexic, I apologize. Though it's been a pleasant change from the tight confines of the caverns. I've drawn out a small map for the area. It's a simple one, and more for completion, really. Not knowing the full extent of a region can be quite frustrating. I'll figure it out for you, bud. Thanks, Cornifer. Yeah, there's really not much right now. But that's okay. What's beyond Cornifer? Hello. Hmm. I can't see. Hmm. Oh. There's a way we can bust through up there. And I think it's accessible by going down... Not there. I did the stupid. Nope, okay. Never mind. Right. I owe two drinks. Keeping these ones a little more spread out. Oh, that was my jaw popping. I don't know if you can hear that. What did I just do? Oh, I went back. Oh, I apologize. All right, platform. Come here, you. I did it again. <laughs> what is wrong with me? There's two more. Okay, I'm not gonna do that again. Hi. There's coming out from the foreground. Hi. Hello. Bye. <laughs> All right.
Oh, I thought I had it. Oh, there he goes. He did my job for me. Here's a drink. Oh, I see butterflies. There's a lifeblood chamber somewhere. Open up the path back. I know what this is. So this is the center of lifeblood. Look how pretty this is. Oh, it's magical. It's a magical adventure. We've got Joni's Blessing, which is another charm. Blessed by Joni, the kindly heretic. Transfigures vital fluids into blue lifeblood. The bearer will have a healthier shell and can take more damage, but they will not be able to heal themselves by focusing soul. So what this is, is we'll immediately have more health to start with, and I believe it'll regenerate automatically, but the cost is I cannot heal myself. It's so pretty. I can't gush enough about this game. It's very artful. Okay, well, we've experienced that little bit of magic. Hello. Ooh, excuse me. Hello, Cornifer, still here. Still drawing his map. All right. So there's lots of goodies on the outside, to the left. But we can explore all the goodies on the inside first. And I think that's it. Hi. Hello. So throughout our descent. Oh boy, I fell too far. Yeah, it's just a couple goodies like geo deposits, but they're worth it to find on the outside. Wee. Okay, we got ourselves another budding tree that will become important later. We have a marker here, so we'll find it when we come back. Okay. dash yet because I don't know what's coming up. Whoa! That apparently. <gasps> Emo Mo Shikun! Wait a minute. I don't trust. I'm going this way. I can't go this way. I guess we're going this way. Ah! Okay. So this is where we fought the two Baldurs. And we needed this power up to climb up. Good old Mantis Claw. Check for illusory walls. Illusory wall is a term often used in uh, Dark Souls. This will take us back to Green Path. Yes, it will. Okay, so we're close to our stag friend. We'll take him back. Oh, hello. You struck me once. There we go. There's a drink. Um, further up. Hmm. 
Mew. Here we are. Oh my god, did you hear that? That was my neck. Woof. Okay. So we can take him back to Hollow Nest so we can see the grub pop up. Because it's been too long since we paid a visit. And I need to cap my gin again. I keep forgetting about it. Oh, I'm gonna spread out. Oh yeah, we still haven't seen uh, Bretta in town. Speak to the devil. Hello. So this is sweet. You just sit next to her. She starts to blush. <laughs> She's so cute. Uh, okay. Yeah, we can go inside her place. Oh, mask shard. Yes, that is very important. The white savior. The maiden woke in darkness. Confused, she reached out. Sharp brambles jabbed at all sides. Burning acid bubbled close below. What nightmare had led her here? What hope of survival remained? Doomed, she thought herself, and to despair she fell. Under a light, until a light bloomed far in the distance, a bright glowing spot fast approaching. It swept majestic about the horns. Oh, the thorns leapt above burning waters and dove towards the maiden. Coming close, the form revealed at last, a beautiful being, sh sharp white, sharp horn, Jesus. <laughs> Sharp horns gleaming white. Arms reached out for the damsel, gathering her up. <laughs> Grip firm. So uh, she's a big fan of us. She's already made several dolls. Or actually, I don't know if she had these beforehand. But she seems to idolize someone that looks just like me. Oh, she gets all nervous when I approach. It's very endearing. All right. So now, we could head back into the caverns. And go see our grub papa. Maybe he'll give us something good. I expect a lot of geo coming. Oh, look at them all! Imamashikun! Let's sit here and let it transpire. <laughs> oh, we got something. Look at it all. Oh, my goodness. Jeez! We got another thing. <laughs> oh, he's still going. <laughs> All right, he made a rain on us. Wow! Oh, we got ourselves a charm, grub song, and a rancid egg. Thank you. Okay. And with that, uh. What that charm in particular does, the grub song, is it will give you soul every time you get hit. Speaking of, I need a drink. Okay. And there's one more thing I need to do now. I've collected the pale ore from Hollow Nest's crown. So what needs to come next is upgrading my nail. So down we go, back to the City of Tears. Bing bong a ding dong diddly do. Our stack friend is great. Alright. We could rest, that's alright. We'll be quick. Whee! Bye-bye! Oh. Mm. 
Good job. You did it. I almost just involuntarily took another drink. Oh, well, I guess I need to now. Okay, there's two. Further down. Okay. Oh, uh, bell fly. Oh, you got me. Right at the edge of the hitbox. Come here, you. I screwed up my heel, by the way. There we go. There's a hit. Oh, come on. I'm losing it. There goes that microphone again. Oh, boy. Come down. All right. We'll continue our descent. Excited to be stronger again. <laughs> I did the thing. Whoa, you swung. I should probably heal. Got another drink. Hear the nail smith at work. Whoopsie. Yes. Ah, uh, mm. Oh, you've returned. I see you have some pale ore. A rare fine metal that. Give me the ore and some geo for my efforts, and I'll reforge your nail to make it stronger. Yes, please. Eight hundred geo, worth it. We can thank our grub papa for all that. As you wish. I'll get to work then. Clang. Look at that. There we go. The reforging is complete. I've added a channel to your nail. It should cut much more efficiently. You'll find it stronger than it used to be. Head out there and test its blade against your foes. Yes. Oops. Wrong button. So now, we have a channeled nail. A cleft weapon of hollowness. The blade is exquisitely balanced. It looks good, too. Whoop. Well, he drowned. And I owed him. Well... <laughs> I won't get to test it out if you keep falling in the water. Alright. Well. I think this is as good a spot to end off as any. So we have a stronger nail. Oh, so these guys take three hits now. Delightful. So, as we gaze out at the rain, Thank you guys so much for enjoying this episode of Hollow Knight. Leave a like if you liked. I'll continue again after this. Uh, look forward to it. I'll see you in the next one. Johnny!